What is good, everybody? I finally have all of my gear ready for the Appalachian Trail. And to keep it short and sweet, this is the gear that I will be starting with on the Appalachian Trail. There she is, the bag. This is a Yard Gear Mountain Drifter. It's a 38 liter bag. I've got an extra pair of Vermont Darn Tough socks. And I've also got another pair on my feet right now. In the side pockets, I've got two smart water bottles. Yeah, and this is the Sawyer Squeeze. And then this is my trekking pole. I've never been someone who's bought expensive trekking poles because I typically don't use them when I'm hiking. So someone from my work got me this as like a going away present. And I thought it would be rude not to take it. So, and then in the front pocket here, my like biggest luxury item is my disc golf disc. I've heard that there's a few courses along the trail and if there's anything I've been into longer than backpacking, it is disc golf. So uh, it'd be really cool to throw this. This is an MVP glitch. It's also like a hybrid catch disc. So it would be awesome to throw a camp and stuff as well. So super excited for this. I'm gonna have a lot of fun. Uh, currently right now I have one rain mitt, but typically I would have two, so this is just an REI rain mitt and pretend that there's another one. And then I have my spoon, Gossamer Gear wooden spoon. I have my steak bag. In here I have steaks, some MSR Groundhog, some Z-Pack steaks, and some aluminum shepherd hook steaks, and I also have my backpacking trowel in there. I have a buff. Uh, I don't use this very often. I will use this as like a pillowcase and in the very seldom scenario where it's really freaking cold and I need to put this around my neck. I have my ultra light sack. This is, <laughs> uh, this is what I would put my ID in, my cards in, my funds and all that good stuff. I put that in here and then come around to the front of the pack. I have two Waymark Lycra shoulder strap pockets. Um, these are the best shoulder strap pockets I've ever had in my life. Uh, currently in this one, I just have some headphones. These are just cheap Apple ones. And then in this one, I have bug spray. I've got my hand sanitizer because that's a must because I don't use toilet paper. I use a bidet. Oh, and also I have a uh, light AF padded hip belt for the winter. All right, open it up here. Uh, at the top, I have part of a Gossamer Gear eighth inch foam pad. This is what I use for a sit pad and also what I'll use as my protection for my sleeping pad in my tent. And then my rain jacket is kind of shoved in there. This is a light heart gear rain jacket. Very durable and has awesome pit zips on it. I have some Amazon dance pants. I have put some DWR coating on this to make them just a little bit water resistant. But for the most part, this is just a added form of extra insulation if I need it or hiking pants. And then my shelter is the Z-Pax Plex Solo. I'm like a below average king. I'm like five foot seven. And this thing is luxurious for me. I've got plenty enough space and it's just a really awesome shelter. Let me show you kind of what the inside of my bag looks like right now. My tent and my rain gear was up here at the top. This is what the inside of my bag looks like. Uh, and then below that is my uh, rest of my sleep system. First thing is my ditty bag. It's just a ditty bag. It's nothing special. It just has all my ditties in it. it. has medicine, gear repair, extra smart water bottle caps. Uh, it's got some Luco tape. It's got some first aid goo. It's got a mini pocket knife. It's got a sewing, small Z-Pack sewing kit. It's got toothbrace and, toothpaste and toothbrush. It's got literally everything you need. So it's 
install in this a small Z-Pack stuff sack. And then I have my cooking kit. I have a Soto selfie night stove, which is super awesome. And it's all inside this mesh bag. And I have a Soto pot with a homemade koozie and a homemade koozie lid. And I also have a microfiber towel in there to clean up after the dishes, so. And then this is my electronics bag. I've got my headlamp in here. It's the Nikkor NU25. I've got a few charging cords. I've got a Nikkor 20,000 milliamp power bank. Then I also have an anchor wall plug and it has two USB-C and it has a regular USB port in it to charge stuff when I'm in town. This is my food bag. This is a Gossamer Gear food bag. I think they call it like a snack sack or something. Inside there I have all my food put in a lock sack, uh, like odor proof bag. So, and I also have my bear hanging kit in there and hanging my food. Don't you worry. And then stuffed loosely in, inside is my down jacket. Uh, this is the enlightened equipment Torrid full zip. The reason I got this one was because it had the hood on it and also it's synthetic insulation. So if uh, it gets wet, it still retains its warmth. Inside my compactor bag, which again, I'll show you. This is my compactor bag. It's all the way at the bottom. It's just a really durable like trash compactor bag that I use as an added waterproofing layer from this pretty much waterproof pack. Inside I have my pillow, just a inflatable Ephemerest pillow. I've got my sleeping pad, which is a Nemo Tensor, mummy style. I have my one piece of mid-layer, which is a Cinchy Merlin. It's made out of alpha fleece. I've got an extra pair of like running shorts. I'll, I'll use these in towns as like an extra shorts or maybe like sleep shorts if I want to sleep in them. But mainly when I'm doing laundry in town, I have an extra pair of shorts. My quilt, which is a UGQ Bandit 20 degree. It's got the open foot box at the end, so I can unzip it and then lay it out completely flat, or I can zip it up, button it, and turn into a quilt. And then last things are my sleeping socks. And these are just some cheap wool sleeping socks. Uh, at the beginning of the trail, I'm going to try to use these as gloves if I need if I need to because um, these are super warm and I've used that on like overnight trips before. But if they don't work out and I need something else, I will switch out to gloves at some point along the trail. Forgot to talk about the clothes that I'll be wearing. Uh, these are my shoes, the Topo Athletic Pursuits, Zero Drop. Also got that cushion on them. Uh, so I'm super excited to try those out. Uh, this is my shirt. This is a Columbia quick dry fishing shirt. I've got my Nike Challenger running shorts and that's pretty much it. There's that trash compactor bag and my now empty backpack. Thank you for watching. I'm so excited to finally get out and start doing it, you know, but for now, thank you for watching and have a good day. Thank you. Bye.